Celebrations for Hispanic Heritage Month are happening all across San Antonio, but one in particular served as a teaching moment in front of the Alamo. Direct descendants of the Texans who fought courageously at the Battle of the Alamo shared their stories to keep these legacies alive. Right here is where the statue of Toribio Lasoya is right now. One block west of Alamo Plaza is a life-size statue of a man in a challenging stance, holding a gun in his right hand. He's Alamo defender Toribio Lasoya. Who was born and raised here at the Alamo and actually died defending the Alamo. Ron Greer is a direct descendant. My great-great-great-grandfather is Toribio Lasoya. Lasoya's mother owned the plot of land where the statue stands now. This was my family's house. It's just time for everyone to tell their stories. Patricia Mota, another descendant in the Lasoya family, says 20 years ago, UTSA did a dig looking through the foundation surrounding the statue. We found a letter from the mayor at that time during the Battle of the Alamo, Ruiz, who signed a letter saying that uh, Toribio Lasoya was one of the fallen heroes. Lasoya's body was found in the Alamo Chapel. His wife and children were able to escape the battle and head south. I'm still learning a lot. This family's ancestry traces back to Spain. Their story is one of many shared with pride and gratitude for the brave defenders of many backgrounds and their contributions to the state of Texas. The Alamo is, is just one part of the puzzle that brings everybody together.